Sebastian Bay is Yannick Sinner and the first Chinese man, Yubing Wu, to win an ATP Tour win this week's Tour uh, level tournament. So Yubing Wu wins the Dallas Open, Sebastian Bay wins the Callover Open, and Montpellier is second seed, Yannick Sinner wins that. So now we are looking to the three tournaments this week. Starting off, we're going to go to the Argentina Open, which I'm pretty sure that I am 99% sure that uh, Sebastian Baez, yes, he's playing it. Carlos Acre is uh, quite a surprising, I thought he would be playing in uh, Netherlands, but he might take it easy after his uh, injury. He might take this tournament a bit easy, like go through it for some 250s. Team also playing as a wild card, well-deserved wild card. Cam Norrie, the second seed. Is Serendulo in here? That's a cool question. No, he's not, I don't think. Yeah, I mean, that's why Musa is the, sec the third seed. So, yeah, quite an interesting draw we got here. Swartzman also gets a bye. Bay is the champion of the Cordoba plays against Duzan Lozovic. Alcaraz should easily account for Laszlo de Gere. But I think Cam Norrie might take this one out. This one, Carlos Alcaraz coming back from injury may not be the same as what he was. Um, his form through the US Open, so I do feel that he might lose this tournament, maybe like a semi-final or a final, but like, uh, he will go a long way, this kid. That being said, I do feel that Nori will take out this title. Moving on to Delray Beach Open, where Taylor Fritz stars as the first seed, who lost against the Yibing Wu. He has a quite an easy round, 16 should be able to win that. Dennis Shapovalvo by should be able to take and take account of that. Tommy Paul also in this tournament against Kula should be able to win that. T John Thompson gets eliminated. Jack Sock also missed. And Ben Shelton also in this tournament. Looking forward to seeing how he plays. JJ Wolf, one of the uh, dark horses. Mackenzie McDonald. All, the, all of them here, Manorino. Quite an interesting draw. I'm gonna go for. I'm gonna go for. A, I feel like Shelton's gonna win this. I don't know why. I think he's gonna pick up his first ATP Tour title. Now the Rotterdam and Murray Open, where 500 the first. Well, I think it's the first or maybe second 500 of the year. Stefan assists past the first seed. Yank Sinner. Wait, how is he not? Oh, wait, because this is a 500, so only eight seeds, top eight seeds. Pretty good draw. Pretty strong draw. Sissipas should have a should could get a tough round of 16 against the Yannick so that will be very interesting. Warinka wins against Bublik. Richard Gasquet wins an upset a win over the seventh seed. Holger Rune disappointingly losing at the semi-final against Maxine Cressy last week. Sun Win Quinn, he had a good start to the season but was poor at the Australian Open. He plays against Alexander Zverev, which is a winnable match for him. Felix Auger, I assume, quite inconsistent. I do think we should be able to get a win there against Sonego. Gregor Beres should be a win, so he's got a ticket to the quarterfinal, hopefully. Grigor Dimitrov wins quite inconsistent. I do think he will get eliminated next round against uh, Brick. Roberto Bustis, Roberto Bustis, Huber, Hukash. Maxime Cressy, Damon Orr, Orr might lose that one. I'm going to say Rublev wins this. So guys, that's going to be the end of the video. Like and subscribe. See you guys in the next episode of my Monday Tennis Show and take care.